Yeah. You might have even gone in looking for his eggs. Well, there's the eggs down there. Okay. Alright. They... I do believe, or my guess would be bearded dragon eggs. Right. Um, they have about a similar, you, you said there was a few more hay. Yeah, and it's about, about a dozen. About well, the right size. Yeah. Um, I will just say it again for educational purposes. But yeah, the embryo is attached to a sack and then once it rolls, it'll drown in the fluid that's inside the egg, unfortunately. But it's not like you went around smashing eggs on purpose, you know, you're just Definitely working not. in the yard so it doesn't, accidents happen. But I would imagine it's, my guess is bearded dragon. So. But I assume they've all been pretty much tossed and turned, hey? Because well, uh, I was just standing here and he was like that. And it stood up at you? And, and I just went, whoa. Okay. That's definitely and yeah, it's it's suspicious. probably that round. Decent decent girth on it. Yeah. And it what definitely wasn't a python hay. Didn't have no idea. It was late. Just because yeah, eleven a little look. head torch on. Yep. And if it's a python, big chance it's in here. Um eleven o'clock at night is not to say brown snakes won't when it's really hot they'll alternate because yesterday wasn't overly hot. Um Suddenly himself like you know what I mean? Yep. All I saw was the Which makes me think it doesn't go all that far. Turning you not down. I wonder if Okay. It's, it appears to go we can right in further. So yeah, we might if there's a sneak. If he's home. Whoa! It's right under there. It's a python. Hello! Hello! <laughs> You're a python! Causing all the trouble. I can see why you thought it's brown though, it's got a nice caramelly yeah. colour. Hello mate, what are you doing? Come here. Can I grab that? If you want to, yeah, thanks for that. Well there you go, that's your culprit. Yeah, 11 o'clock at night, not to say you never get an eastern brown that time of night, but much more likely to be one of these guys. Because yeah. he's nocturnal. Hey mate, hey, we wake you up, did we? Settle it down, settle it down. So he's yeah, just a juvenile still. Yep. Like, oh mate, come on, that's not that bad. If I hold you with two hands, you might settle down a bit more, eh? So is it. I wonder if I got you on camera when I lifted that up. Oh, doggy, doggy, doggy. Watch out. Missing its tail, look at that. Oh. I would not uh, be surprised if the big dogs maybe had a bit of a... Oh. To be honest, missing tails isn't unusual, yep. but what I reckon with it being nubby like that is that it's actually had skin stuck around its tail and it's actually lost that tail from skin. <laughs> Maybe not, it could have been bitten off, but wait, where are you going? Trying to go back home. Hey, I know that was a good spot up in there, wasn't it? <laughs> That's the way. I can send you all this too if you want. That's a beautiful shot. That's going to be... A that's the keeper right there yeah so what's happening is yeah is that orange color will probably actually go more brown as he ages because you catch the hatchlings and they're pretty much like bright orange and the pattern on the juveniles is almost absent it's really really faint if if they're at all so this these black the black marks that are there they they look mottled and patchy at the moment but they'll actually should solid up over the over the years so you know when you see the big ones and they've got a really distinct black outline around the pattern? Mm -hmm. So that should change over time for this guy. I'd imagine he's still only, oh, I think he's pretty big for his age to be honest. So I think it's only a couple of years old. Hey, hey, you're not going back. <laughs> Alright, let's put you in the bag then before you, you can't go back mate. There's a beautiful looking snake down there. There's um, oh, my bag's over here. Look at him just going in on his own. Maybe. Come on, yeah, it's a cave. It's a cave. Nah, he's onto it. Because, <laughs> yeah, a cave that smells like a million other snakes. Yep. There he goes. There he is. Yeah, it could have been attacked by something with that tail, but that's actually quite a common thing.